title, The Helpful Monkey and the Lost Parrot. Once upon a time, in a lush and vibrant jungle, lived a mischievous monkey named Max. Max was always up to some playful tricks and was known for his pranks. One sunny morning, as Max swung from tree to tree, he heard a distant cry for help. Following the sound, Max came across a colorful parrot named Polly who was perched on a branch. Sobbing, Max asked, Why are you crying, Polly? Polly sniffled and replied, I've lost my way home, Max. I don't know how to get back to my family. Max though, mischievous, had a kind heart. He knew he couldn't leave Polly alone in the jungle. So, he decided to help her find her way home. They embarked on an adventure together. With Max swinging through the treetops and Polly guiding him with her colorful plumage. Along the way they encountered various animals who needed assistance. Like a turtle stuck on its back and a squirrel who had lost its acorns. Max and Polly stopped to help every creature they met. Max even used his clever tricks to solve some of the problems. Like using a long stick to flip the turtle back onto its feet and collecting acorns for the squirrel. As they continue their journey, Polly noticed that Max had changed. He was no longer the mischievous monkey who played pranks on others. Instead, he was kind, helpful, and caring. Finally, after a long day of helping others, they reached Polly's home tree. Polly was overjoyed to be reunited with her family. And she thanked Max with tears of gratitude. Max smiled and said, I used to be mischievous. But helping you and others in need has shown me that being kind and helpful is much more rewarding. Polly nodded in agreement and Max swung back into the jungle. A changed monkey from that day on, he became known as Helpful Max and continued to assist his
fellow jungle inhabitants, whenever they needed him. The moral of the story is that kindness and helping others can change a person for the better. So, always be ready to lend a helping hand, just like helpful, Max. The end. Title, The Helpful Little Ant. Once upon a time, in a colorful meadow, there lived a little ant, named Andy. Andy was known, for being the most, helpful ant in the, entire ant colony. He loved helping, his fellow ants with, their daily tasks. One sunny morning, as Andy was scurrying, around collecting food, for the colony. He noticed a, struggling grasshopper, named Gilly. Gilly had a broken, leg and couldn't hop, around to find food. Andy, being the, kind-hearted ant he, was approached, Gilly and said. Don't worry Gilly, I'll help you find, some food. And so, Andy started, gathering tasty leaves, and juicy berries and, brought them to Gilly. Gilly was amazed, by Andy's kindness, and said, Thank you so much, Andy, you're the best, friend I've ever had. From that day on, Andy and Gilly became, the best of friends. Andy continued to, help Gilly by bringing, him food every day. In return, Gilly played, beautiful tunes on his, tiny violin to lift, Andy's spirits. One day, a big, rainstorm came, and the meadow, flooded. The ant colony, was in trouble, because their underground, home was filling up, with water. The ant queen was, so impressed by Andy's, selflessness and, bravery that she, declared. Andy, you are now, our official helper and, protector of the colony. And so Andy, the ant became a, hero. Not just for, helping his friend, Gilly but for saving, his entire ant colony. He learned that being, kind and helpful not only, makes you a good, friend but also a, true hero. The moral of, the story is, Kindness and helpfulness, can turn you into a hero, in the eyes of others. So, my little friends, always remember to, be like Andy. The helpful ant, and make the world, a better place with, your kindness.
title, The Brave Little Turtle. In a tranquil pond, nestled deep within, a dense forest there, lived a little turtle, named Timmy. Timmy was unlike the other turtles, he was curious and adventurous. While his turtle friends preferred to stay in their cozy shells, Timmy longed to explore the world beyond the pond. One sunny morning, as Timmy basked on a rock near the water's edge, he saw a group of colorful butterflies fluttering about. They seemed to be in a hurry and their worried chattering caught Timmy's attention. Curiosity got the best of Timmy and he decided to approach the butterflies They explained that their home, the Enchanted Butterfly Meadow, was in danger. A fierce storm had damaged their meadow and they needed help to repair it. Without a second thought, Timmy offered his assistance. The butterflies were astonished by his bravery and agreed to guide him to their meadow. It was a breathtaking sight filled with vibrant flowers and sparkling streams. But it was in ruins with fallen trees and damaged flowers everywhere. The butterflies explained that they needed someone brave and strong to help them restore their home. Timmy took charge, organizing the butterflies into teams to clear debris and mend the flowers. He worked tirelessly, leading by example, day by day. The meadow began to transform and the butterfly's spirits lifted. Word of Timmy's bravery and determination spread throughout the meadow, inspiring the other animals to join in the effort. Birds helped build nests, squirrels gathered nuts and even the forest, creatures lent a hand. As the meadow blossomed once more, the butterflies were overjoyed and threw a grand celebration in Timmy's honor. And through a grand celebration in Timmy's honor, they adorned his Shell with the most beautiful butterfly designs and gave him a magical necklace that would protect him on all his future adventures. Timmy returned to his pond not only as the bravest turtle but also as a hero and a friend to all the creatures in the forest. He had proven that even the smallest among us can make a big difference by showing courage and kindness. The moral of the story is that bravery and selflessness can lead to incredible adventures and friendships. Just like Timmy, 
Let's be brave and always lend a helping hand when others need it, for you never know where your courage might take you. The End The Magical Adventure of Timmy and the Talking Teddy Bear Once upon a time in a small cozy town there lived a young boy named Timmy. Timmy was a curious and adventurous kid who loved exploring the world around him. He had a special friend who was always by his side a teddy bear named Teddy. Now, Teddy wasn't just any ordinary teddy bear. He had a magical secret every night. When Timmy was fast asleep, Teddy would come to life and embark on incredible adventures in the world of toys and imagination. One moonlit night, as Timmy lay peacefully in his bed, Teddy suddenly came to life. With a gentle, magical shimmer, Teddy's furry body transformed into a talking, walking bear, Timmy, it's time for an adventure, Teddy whispered in excitement. Timmy, who was a deep sleeper, didn't wake up, so Teddy knew he had to be careful not to make too much noise. With quiet steps, Teddy tiptoed out of Timmy's room and into the hallway. Outside, the world was bathed in the soft silvery glow of the moon. Teddy led the way to the backyard where they found a tiny, sparkling door. Come on, Timmy, Teddy urged as he opened the door and stepped through Timmy. Timmy, still fast asleep was pulled along by Teddy's magical adventure. They emerged in a world filled with giant candy canes, talking animals, and colorful landscapes. Teddy explained, This is the land of imagination, Timmy, where dreams come true. Together, they hopped onto a candy cane train that took them on a roller coaster ride. Through candy, mountains, and whipped cream valleys, they met a friendly dragon who taught them to breathe bubbles instead of fire, and they even had a tea party with a group of chatty. Squirrels. As the night turned into day, Teddy knew it was time to return home. They found the sparkling door again and stepped back into Timmy's room. Teddy transformed back into a teddy bear just in time. The next morning, Timmy woke up with a wide smile on his face, feeling like he had just had the most incredible dream. He reached for Teddy and hugged him tightly. 
We had an amazing adventure, didn't we, Teddy? Teddy, who knew the secret of their magical journey, simply winked. And they shared a special moment of understanding. From that day on, Timmy and Teddy continued to have many more adventures together. Both in the real world and the land of imagination. And every night, as Timmy drifted, Off to sleep, he couldn't wait to see where Teddy would take him next. So, kids, always remember that imagination can take you on the most incredible adventures. Even with your best furry friends by your side, and who knows? Maybe your teddy bear has a magical secret too.